I'm Stuart Thompson, I'm the restaurant manager in the Ox and Finch. So a restaurant manager, we deal with um, the bookings, we organise the booking sheets every day, take bookings, deal with larger parties, structure the rota, organise the waitresses and the team members into sections and make sure every customer has been looked after. Very much about casual dining in here. We cater for the guests when they require it, but we, we tend to let them enjoy the experience as much as they can. And once we've got their drinks, we've got their order, we kind of kind of leave them to it. We're not really into fussy service. It's more about enjoying the food and enjoying the drink. I think, especially in Glasgow, it's uh, they're more used to that sort of thing, so they tend to enjoy it a wee bit more. I certainly do. Uh, that's how I like to enjoy my enjoy my food and my experience when I go out. Um, so it's what we're all about, really. The service is just as important as the food. If you give bad service, then you're kind of throwing the kitchen under the bus because they, they work, work so hard for the dishes. And then if the customer receives bad service, it kind of makes it for nothing, really. So service and food need to be of a really high standard. In Glasgow, it's actually sell it. It's got kind of a lot of similar flavours to to a kebab, um, that's how we'd sell it in Glasgow, don't tell, don't tell Chef that, I don't know if he'd be too happy with that, um, but it's a really exciting dish, it's an explosion of flavour, um, the, the flavour from the, the Scotch lamb is just delicious, it's just got a lot going on in that dish. I actually find with that dish, if a, if a customer orders it, they tend to reorder it again, because they, they're just enjoying it so much. I would actually choose our red of the month that we're doing at the moment, it's a, it's a baby amarone, it's a sarai, it's a... Um, it's very velvety and smooth. I'm just going to balance that with the spiciness of the lamb dish. I want to be here for the foreseeable future and look forward to exciting things to come uh, with the new ventures and hopefully be involved in them when they, when they get more underway.